Casey and the sports doctor here on a hot July night at New London High School. And hard to believe that although the All-Star game just passed in baseball, it's football season already. One of the two host sites of this year's high school passing league. And we start off our game day coverage of previews of this year's high school quarterback class. Starting off with the Stonington High School Bears, junior Marco Tedeschi and sophomore Drew Champagne. One of the first times we've got two here, sports doctor, not one standing in front of us. A little something different. Yeah, guys, a bit of a healthy competition this year uh, heading into camp here at the passing league between the two of you guys? Yeah, I yeah. guess so. I mean, what's what's the big takeaway from this? Uh, what are you trying to achieve, you know, Marco, out there in the field? I can speak for uh, the both of us that we're just trying to, like, get used to the offense and our teammates this year. Is it, it's got to be a lot of fun being on guys, though. Yeah. Just yeah, getting, no, getting the field of football again. Like I said, it's the middle of summer, but just getting back on the field, getting the feel of the ball, you know, getting some of the timing patterns down, it's got to help when, you, when you're going to camp next month. Oh, yeah, yeah, I will. So, you know, when we were uh, your age a long, long time ago, uh, there was no passing league. Summertime was sort of a, a, a dead time for football, maybe some weightlifting. Uh, the yeah. passing league has really kind of changed yeah. the landscape. Coming That's in for you, and when I ask Drew first, then you, Marco, mm -hmm. what is it that you hope, in, you know, personally, to achieve? What's the passing league for you? Well, my biggest thing is that it's getting me used to the offense, as I already said, and that the teammates and I want to get used to like how everyone runs their routes and how like to get used to get used to the defense that I haven't seen in the past six months. Marco? No, yeah, with Drew said, uh, timing the receivers, um, just really learning all the routes and stuff. You know? Now it's apparent early on that even though the two of you are you know, sort of competing for a job, mm -hmm. you know, there's clearly a relationship between the two of you as well, yeah. uh, supporting one another. Mm -hmm. uh, what do you think that brings and says to the rest of your teammates, how you interact with each other for the rest of the Stonington Bears here, you know, while you're sort of leading them on the field? I mean, like, I don't know, it just shows them that like, we all have a good time. Oh. It's like a friendly competition. Yeah, like you said earlier. Really. It's not just like the winner, the whoever gets the spot isn't like a loser because it's like. Are the coaches yeah. tough over there too, or are they kind of laxed on you guys a little bit? No, they're tough on us. Yeah, they're tough. Yeah. yeah, just keep us on our feet. Now, last year you were a freshman, you played freshman football, JV football, JV and played quarterback. And Marco, what about you last year? No, I was a starting quarterback last year. Okay, so coming into the season, starting quarterback last year, mm -hmm. it's okay to feel like you know healthy competition but oh, yeah. you want to win this job oh, yeah, you want to go lead this team mm -hmm. now from your side of things i think um you know how do you approach you gotta you've got the incumbent in front of you you played last year you, you wanna so what do you envision the best way that you can help the team through him uh well i, I see it as like if marco gets the spot he's he's already got the experience and if i get it they can look at it as that we already have a quarterback who is the quarterback last year who can give experience to me and like you know, it's July, and it's a long ways right, away. Definitely. It's July, it's a long ways away. But I'm sure you guys got the uh, Wesley game already penciled down in your calendar oh, yeah, for next year. Of course. It's a big deal, isn't it? Yeah, it is. <laughs> it's good stuff. So, Marco, what's the one thing that you think you need to improve on to be a better quarterback than you were last year? Um, the confidence, really. Um, making better reads, reading the defense better. Just, I can prove my game all around. There you go. And if you see him do something that you see, you feel comfortable going up to him and saying, hey, this is what I saw? Yeah, for sure. Yeah, we correct each other a lot. Healthy competition, Casey, here at Stonington. 